available. And, oh, and that's the one uh, I have them on. Rick has on and yep. Kelly has on in the hour. Oh, yeah, these are great. All so right. these are suede. Suede. And our, again, our clog business is doing really well. This is a different kind. Of, if those of you have seen the Boston, which is a regular strap around the front, uh, enclosed shoe, which is great for the fall. Okay. Actually, for the summer, you can wear these with shorts, with a all, skirt, all with jeans. Year. All year. All um, year. Yep. For so sure. that's a great looking, great looking clog. You, all you need is water stain repellent. Spray a little water stain repellent just to keep it. And it's also got a soft footbed in it. So. There's a you can't really feel it at home, newer? but that yeah, the, it's newer. Um, it this is we sell it kind of like training wheels for people that have never worn Birkenstocks before. Now you can yeah try try well, that on. It might be a little. So anyone that's oh. anyone that's had Birkenstocks oh. on that just feel like it's too hard, these are <laughs> little training wheels inches, for you. Yeah, it's <laughs> worth wow. it. Wow, where'd she <laughs> go, Denise? <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> um, oh. <laughs> I know, isn't it amazing? Okay, so I there's think it's a layer mandatory of, there's that we a wear layer. Birkenstocks here in the studio. <laughs> <laughs> there's a layer of foam underneath it. So basically, uh, they're training wheels. We sell it like training wheels. So when you wear them, you'll feel a little cushion. The cushion oh. will break down, and then you can get into the regular Birkenstock. So these are great. So you have softness on the top. You have the softness of the suede, and then you have the softness of the soft footbed. Very soft. Very soft. Your feet Do you will feel just that? love I know. Them. It makes it. Aren't they? It is. They're Anyone like that's slippers. never worn them before always goes for those because, because they're softer. Yeah. Okay. Initially, so. Good. So we want to welcome Rick Tosh, who's joining us. Hello. It's a Happy pleasure. Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving well, thank to everybody. You. Happy early Thanksgiving to you. Yes. Hey, thanks. And yeah, we have another lunch. <laughs> exactly. exactly. I had turkey today. I was telling everyone I had a turkey sandwich. Did you? Well, there yeah, you sure. go. So you're getting I in the spirit. Here. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, we yeah. appreciate yeah. that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we should point out that Rick is a field educator for uh, Berkey's and Batula, and mm -hmm. Birk the Birkenstocks Perfect. company, exactly. all over North America, and he's uh, spending time with us today sharing these fantastic styles, and uh, pop to say this is a popular shoe line is an understatement. Right. This it is. is it worldwide. Is. It is worldwide. We've been making custom footbeds or general orthotic for over 230 years since 1774. Wow. So it's still run by the Birkenstock family in ba Bad Honnef, Germany. So uh, they're still handmade and we believe in like over-the-counter orthopedic footwear or a general orthotic. So that's what this is. It's gonna support the four main arches that you have, uh -huh. the deep heel cup, the toe bar, it's gonna exercise your feet, increase circulation, and we have like a little flair too. We'll oh, try I, to be a little stylish. See, that's so, what we love. I mean, great design. Right. But when you put your feet in, in the Berkey shoes or the Batula shoes that we're gonna be sharing with you, you can just hear them go, oh, yeah. thank you. There's just this. Relief. Exactly. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> I found my home. Right. We're gonna start off with uh, this particular crisscross Chris Cross Clog. That's hard to say. It is. Chris We've been trying to sing that all day. <laughs> well, you get the idea. Chris Cross, and it's a clog, and it's available here for the shopping channel at $119, even 381264 is the number for you. Now, we have this actually in two designs. We're showing you the black, mm -hmm. but we also have the uh, Paris. So we have the black floral. Correct. And we also have available for you the pa retro Paris. Right. So it and has I, a little Paris theme to it. And yep. we'll see. I and guess we'll see uh, Heidi wearing that one. Sure. Right, Heidi? But so. this is a, um, it's a kind of a Mary Jane crisscross clog. Mm -hmm. There, I said it. Uh, and so you can have a, a micro adjustments. So the straps can go across to accommodate different uh, insteps. If your instep's really big, you can back the straps off. If okay. you have like a little smaller instep, you uh -huh. can uh, cinch it down a little tighter. They're made to be worn loosely, so you want to be able to put your finger right underneath the straps. So you let the footbed do the work. Now this is uh, not leather. It looks like leather. It's yeah. called Burka Floor. So Burka it's a synthetic floor. and wears just as well as leather. It, it's tear Feels resistant and on the inside you can feel the, uh, the felt. There's like felt on the oh, inside. Yes. And, and that's going to keep your, it's breathable, so that's going to keep your foot nice and dry. Very and, smooth. Uh, and very, very stylish, too, and the we flowers. Have, exactly. The mm -hmm. black with the flowers, very attractive, great for fall. We're going to see, we do have a second design, which we'll show you in just a moment, which is the uh, Retro Paris, mm -hmm. which we'll have on Heidi in just a second. Uh, but this is, the, the, the base, as you said, or the, the foundation, excuse mm -hmm. the pun, oh, yeah. of the entire line <laughs> is the footbed, right? It's, it's, exactly. It's getting your foot in the right, right. right They're position. Right. They're all the, the Berkey's and the Batula line will have the same footbed. Uh, the characteristics are basically a, uh, a deep yeah, heel let's cup. Let's show that over here oh, sure. if we can. A deep heel cup. So you have your deep heel cup. That's going to create a pad for your heel. You put 500 pounds of pressure on your heel with each step. Wow. So that's a lot. And to, to be able to put your muscles and tendons together to have like a little padding helps a lot. Uh -huh. This is a neutral heel. We don't believe in, in having people with heels. 
So it's your foot is going to be right even with the ground, okay. perfectly so don't even. Don't look so. at my shoes. No. I, saw, I already. I look. That's all I do is look at people's shoes. I guess. That's yeah, pathetic. that would. So uh, I, there's hazard. four main. Uh, there's four main arches right here. You have a, your lateral, your metatarsal, your medial, and your transverse. So that's uh, basically holding your weight. Uh, you have 26 bones in your feet, 32 muscles and tendons, 107 ligaments, all holding your weight. Carrying heavy objects is unbelievably puts stress on your feet, your back, mm -hmm. your hips. And you have like a nice little toe bar here, and that's what's going to increase your circulation. Your toes are going to grip the that bar. That feels and exercise so good. Your feet. Yeah. On your toes, like right. it's just like that little, like a massage or something yeah. around. Yeah, the knuckles your toe. of your toe just sits over it, and you're, and you, you don't even know you're doing it no. in your mind. So you just walk, and it keeps the shoe from flying off your foot. That's most important. <laughs> so, uh, and then you have an oblique toe. We believe in having an oblique a, toe. Oblique. It's called oblique. That is, what is one it? of the words of the day. Okay. So it keeps your foot in its natural shape. So a lot of shoes that people wear come to a point, and then your foot ends up taking that shape. You know, people could get bunions. I mean, bunions are hereditary, but mm -hmm. you could. You know, you're putting a lot of pressure on the ball of your foot, so uh, why not, if you can't wear them and you're a professional person, you uh -huh. know, you can wear these on your commute or Absolutely. at home. So. Exactly. Yeah. That's right. Over lunchtime yeah, on the exactly. weekends. And many of you, we understand, and, and, and good for you, have a wardrobe of either Berkey's or Batula's mm -hmm. as well. And now this is a, a Berkey shoe. What is the difference between Berkey's and Batula's? Berkey's and Batula, um, Birkenstock has different collections, uh, okay. about seven, seven different collections. The Berkey's and the Batula, uh, the shopping channel love because they're fun, funky colors. Okay. Um, a lot of pizzazz, a lot of zip, and you still get the benefits of the footbed, but um, that's what you're going to see, a lot of um, a lot of trendy colors. Um, they try to uh, oh, okay. come up with the trends Great. and the colors and the textures that are going on for the fall and the Beautiful. summer. Well, and so. I'm, I'm just wondering, do we have the second design, guys? Corey, do we have the second pattern in this? Because we have the black floral, we have the Paris retro. That's two different color choices. So, and there's also hearts. Oh, okay. So we have three different color choices for your pattern choices, I guess right. we could say, available for you. We're focusing on the black floral at right. the moment. Uh, so here's the item number. 381264 is the number for you to $119 even. And three easy pays available for you as well. And uh, we will have uh, the sizing chart coming up for you in just a moment mm -hmm. also so that right. you can find the, the right size for you because the sizing is done in... In it's more uh, European it's, yeah, sizes? Yeah, a lot of people that wear Birkenstock are used to European sizing. There it is mm -hmm. right there. Um, but you, we do North American sizing, too. I mean, this is a worldwide shoe. Right. So you are going to have all different kind of conversions, but most people know either the uh, North American or the Euro, and there's your conversion right there. That's real easy. And if you're in a half size, say you're a six and a half, uh -huh. you see that six right there, I would stay with a 37. Okay. If you think you're maybe one size up, I'd try the size up. So okay. they should be made to be worn loosely. Make sure your heel's all the way back and there's a quarter to an eighth of an inch in the front of the shoe and you're off and running. That's the best part about Birkenstocks. You can tell if they fit or not. You know, that's uh, you true. You just look down. And so, uh, you yeah, can and tell you can by feel the feel it. of it, too. Exactly. Absolutely. You're the way right. that you want the, exactly your heel to sit right in that deep heel cup. Exactly. You don't want your heel right at the very, very edge. You want it to sit, as you said, right in the actual right. uh, setting for it. And then also, of course, you'll feel it right over that, uh, what is that called? The toe bar? Yep, the you'll toe bar. You'll feel your toe is just resting perfectly mm -hmm. over that toe bar as well. Yeah, we were talking earlier. You knew when yours didn't fit. Yeah. You know, so yeah. It's, it'll You'll know if it doesn't fit. Oh, absolutely. For sure. So now we're going to move on. We're going to share more with you. We also have the crisscross clog. I have to say that slowly. The crisscross criss -cross clog. clog. See, you're so good. See, he's, he's I a say professional. It all the time. Exactly. I say it in my sleep, I think. <laughs> it's, under, it's under item number 381265. Now we have the solid version of what we were just, right. basically what we were just sharing. We have it in the white. We're going to see Kathy in the black. And